today we're going to that place that I had to walk past pretty quickly but today we're going to look at all these cars in here including Brum, which is a childhood memory type thing for me um, I've been here before a lot when I was little You been here? No Morgan's never been here before but we'll see what happens and we'll go to this place and look around show you guys as much as we can so we've made our way in, uh, you can't touch the cars unfortunately, I mean, you might get copyrighted, but there's some really cool cars here. Come on, focus on the car, there you go. Really cool cars. I'm going to try and show as much as I can um, as we walk around. There's all this cool stuff too. Yeah, pretty sure we can. But I don't see why I can't video. This is cool. I'm going to change the mode on the camera in a sec, but yeah, this is cool. Nice that we've got uh, this quiz thing. Yeah, but the first question is, what is the maximum speed limit in the museum? And the maximum speed limit in the museum is 15 miles an hour. Oh my god. <laughs> do you want to do the writing now? You're going to drive your car through here. Yeah, then. I'll drive this. <laughs> if they start. So you, you, you can drive your car through here, but you yeah. might have a little bit of, you might have a little bit of trouble. So there's all these questions. <laughs> what does that mean? What? It means answers are on the back. Oh. Is that right? We have to do the quiz. No, we're not doing the quiz. We're just going to look around. But like I said, I've already been around here. I've changed the camera mode now. Oh, that is nice. That's a nice car. I like these old bikes as well. They're really, really cool. It is. It is. Anyway. We watched, um, it was called Once Upon Hollywood. Um, it was in there. But so cool in here. And there's like people in the car snap. Look. They're cardboard car arms, but. Little Michelin man down there. There's like more cars, and you can see like they're all like pretty in pristine condition because I think this is some sort of airtight building and stuff. But there's all the old Austins, and it's like got all like the people in them. I'm not sure, but like, they're all nice, old, they're like all pristine as well. This is really cool. For hire, taxi. Okay. Okay, that's a cool car over there as well. This camera brings up all the light as well, all the sparks and stuff. So we he's an actor. I swear he's an actor. I don't know. They're probably all famous people, but I just don't know. You can't see anything in here, but. I can't see it. It's a taxi. Oh, that makes sense. Morgan's talking about this taxi, by the way. <laughs> oh god, I touched it. Oops. It's really like Michelin hats. I know. But these are really cool as well. <sighs> Brum! This isn't a joke, right? But when I was little, I guess. When I was little, um, I used to watch Brum all the time on television. Literally all the time. Oh, it's little Brum. This is the one from the movie. Is it? Yeah. What? Uh, no, wait, what? Brum's going around by. Look, Brum's going around Bolton on the water. It's not fiery. It's Bolton on the water. It's but his lights turn on. How do you make. How do you make his lights turn on? This is Brum. I used to watch the TV show all the time. All the time. And it's so cool. 
it always used to be different when I used to come here because I always thought this wing was further down. But look, it's like going. If you look down there, it's going round on the TV. Yeah, there's a uh, a four cylinder engine or three cylinder. No, it's a four. That's cool. Really cool. Oh, you can take it. So much like memorabilia and minis. And oh, they all say please don't touch. Yeah, you can't touch any of them. Not in here at least. No. But that brum was cool. I absolutely love brum. Next thing, there is a brum. Apparently. And there is a, a cow seat. <laughs> a nice horsey. And as always, we'll, uh, Stroke the horsey, even though we're not allowed to touch it. So let's do this. We are actually outside as well. There's an old tractor. You might need to be able to wind noise. I'm not too sure. Honestly, I thought that was an actual guy. But that's really cool in here. You know, when I said it wasn't a real guy, it bloody sounded like a real guy. I thought he was a hitting. real person. He's actually hitting that, actually scared the life out of me. Are you going to do anything? Hey, look, that thing is hammering, it's like chipped away. I know. You were Let's go talking. A fair pace. Let's go in and screw yeah, into some wood. Job. They're all talking. It's all this old. That's not car, I think. It's got a motorbike. All the wheels. Old school stuff. Is there anything back there? Back outside in the exhibition to continue this way. We're going to go back and see if we can find some more cool stuff in here. It's not going to focus very well. This place is cool. There's a dude in there. Mm -hmm. He's not real. But... Imagine how you like climb up. Oh, there it is. Okay. And then. There's more like really cool old cars. These are all wind up, by the way. Most of them. In here. It's like a. You get the hot donkey and it pulls you. What's that for over there? This is so cool. Do you want to know the reason why I said it was pulled by something? Because there's quite literally a donkey sat there. There's a bar at the back of that one. Look, there's all these cool, like, remember, that's the place we're staying at. That's the place we're staying at. That's the place we are at. And it used to be an old mill. Old school water pump. Shop in there, which isn't actually a shop, obviously. All these cool old cars, stuff in here looks so cool. There's a traffic light up there. Come on, this turned on. Police officer on his bike. This car is cool. Let's see if we can get a shot of it. How cool that looks. Oh, 
what I've just realised in this room is. There's a chicken. <laughs> Have you seen the chicken? Yeah. Morgan's just noticed that there's some really old school cameras over here which I didn't see. Um, some kindling. Some really old school cameras. Really cool. And the traffic light actually changes. That's cool. Going in this room sometime. Huh? To what? I don't know, it can't be quite dangerous to do a rally. We're going in here. Sometimes you see these on the road. I don't, I'm not 100% sure what they're called. Oh yeah, Morgan Supersport. Sometimes you see these cars on the road. Like two wheels at the front, one at the back. I think there was one at the um all oh, car chilling back there. There's all gas pumps. They might have taken them out. Why is turtle wax so expensive? Turtles have small ears. This looks so cool though. The engine. There was an engine one by now, but I forgot to. <laughs> I would love to touch that. But I'm not going to. But it would do an air horn. Huh? That's sad. That's actually quite sad. It's actually really sad. But yeah. Alright, I'd like your finest, um, whatever they are. Some of these cars do get damaged by people. We can ring it. I'm going to read, I'm going to listen to this actually. Moving on a little bit further, more cars, a nice old bike. Get to see some more gas pumps. There you go. Look at the tiny car. No, you don't have to touch anything. It is, uh, it's kind of annoying, but it makes sense. Because if I touch this, for instance, then it could just snap because it's old. Oh, there was another car in that other room, and it said you couldn't touch it. And I think that was the one at the beginning where it said a visitor broke this. I think it's door handle. But he's gas pumps really cool. Yeah, they're 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 really cool. Yeah, they Oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, I thought you meant in there. Let's go to the paved paradise. Small post box over there. Can you see it? I'll go in here and look around a sec. More bikes. Dog over there. Someone on the radio. Really old school mini. Go in there. Go in that. Yeah, free. Right, 
It's on recording. What well, am I recording you then? Not taking a photo? Am I supposed to take a photo? The old school cars. Once again, we can't touch anything. That's a mini. Yeah. That's a mini over there. If I ever, ever, ever buy an old, old, old school car, it will be, okay, it will be an old Triumph. Because that's how, they're not very fast. Buy one of these. Wait, it's drive tech, fourth gear. Oh God. It's drive, fourth gear tech. That's an automatic. What's one, two, three then? You can put it in gears. <gasps> this song, and I'm putting it copyrighted. But my uncle, he used to sing this song. I don't know why, he just did. Anyway, back to the story about the Triumph. If I was ever going to get an old car, it would be one of these. But I'd get it with two of these. An old Volvo. Hello, James Bond. Oh, that's cool. But look at these. That's an old fuel pump. Oh, it's 50 year flashback to 1969. I love these. Look, it's James Bond. But this is an old camp van. How cool this is. Pretty sure we're not to touch this though. I think so. Is this what like children's seats look like? I don't think so. It might be. Yeah, it is, because it's strapped in. I'd get one of them. Do they have engines? Yeah, they do. There's a radiator in there, though. It's all like recording softwares and old bikes. I mean, like moped things. And there's some actual ones here. Huh? It's an Land Rover Series 2, but they're like absolutely massive. I can't even get this whole thing in shot. It's a camper van version. It's like a, I was gonna say hippie camper van. Yeah, but look at it. Look how cool these cars look. They look so cool. Also, that's the exit. Old gas pump. We might go look around at some more stuff here. Not sure though. Look oh, yeah. at She has an event. Maybe got it so you can like stand up in there. Probably. At one point, yeah, probably. Not sure about now. This is so cool in here though. So in the Gloucestershire area, if you guys don't know if you're from a different part of the country, we have these things called hares and they're absolutely everywhere. Um, but this is outside that bit where we were just in a second ago. Um, I'm assuming we could have gone in there if we'd come at a certain time of year. Um, obviously this probably goes. No, the gate's shut. So I'm going to go in there. But it's part of the river as well and there is like a little car in there. Can you see it through the window maybe? But this place is literally on the river. And it's so cool. Right there. <laughs> if you guys didn't hear what Morgan just said, she just asked me where the river was.
yeah, there's got old traffic lights and everything. Some sheep and a pig, just chilling. Soil cool over here. Of course, you got like this old, kind of like wagon type thing. There you go. And you got all the old signs. So in the Gloucestershire area, like I said, there's a bunch of these hares um, around in the place. Oh, the displays can you continue this way? But me and Morgan, well, I used to have these at playgroup, but Morgan used to have one for herself as well. They're like little, some of them you can get with like pedals, but mostly you just put your feet in there. They don't have pedals. Some do, the new ones do. Yeah, but like when we were young, they did them. You just literally like wheeled along. And these are all the old signs. I'm pretty sure we could see them in like forever. We're going to go through this door because apparently the displays continue. Come through the door. There's all these old like little toy cars and stuff. So cool in here as well. Eddie Stobart. Mom is obsessed with the Eddie Stobart I'm not lorries. With them. I just think they're cool. She's uh, she is going on about how there's uh, women's names and stuff on the front. They always have two female names. They're so cool. They're okay, but like when we were at the Gloucestershire Steam Festival, there was tons of those. But like that small as well. But this is so cool. And there's stuff hanging from the ceiling. I get quite annoyed about this into you into spider stuff, but. We're in the toy section. Old cars. These are all the toy sections, by the way. Is there any old things that I'd buy? Old Ford Escort. <laughs> That's relatively new. 2009 Ford Cougar. Focus RS 2001 and the 2010 forwards over here. Are these are like newish cars. Hey, look, it's a Fiesta. Hey, there's a Mondeo, like the old one. Yeah, that they go all the way down, it's like they change because that's what Dean's got that model. Oh my god, it is as well. And then there's the Ford Fiesta that I would like. Wait, where? And then there's that 4KA from 2010. You'll find the Mitsubishi section. There's all the Fords and stuff there. All these old Fords and stuff look so cool. Got these little cars as well. Focus. There we go. Look at all of these cars and stuff. Look at the minis. That car there, that my dad used to have. And he wants it for his first car. It's a Morris Minor. Uh, Morris Travel, actually. Basically, everywhere that's old, you can probably find one of those. And Morgan's mum used to have one of them. Mini. Mini. Who is the that might not be. You might do. There's all these cool, like, old, they're old scooters. Look, look at the old scooters. But that's a toy car. That brown one. Again, <laughs> this is obviously the kids section, but is this the one I, I think kids can actually sit in. Yeah, kids can go in that one though. Yeah. I did as a kid. <laughs> oh. Can you sit in it? Yeah. No, can you sit in that? Don't you think I'm a bit big for that? Can you get in it though? I really want to. No, that. 
brum thing. Yeah, I want to see you see you in the brum. I don't think I can. I will break it. They've got a weight limit. See if you can sit in it. Oh my god, you can insert coins as well. How much? Um, 30p for one ride. Oh, that's a bit of a rip off. <laughs> I can't get in. <laughs> I can't see. She can't get in, but if she did. But it's all just like old brum memorabilia. And you can like turn this stuff so it changes. Obviously, it costs 10p, but I'm not going to do that. A bunch of mirrors. Right, here's a big bush. Yeah. You guys can see me. That kind of scared me actually. All the stuff in there just lit up. Really cool. Uh, no. No entry up there, though. Apparently, you can see me as well. Come on. But that's basically it, because that's the way out. All the trophies in here that I didn't see. Because I wasn't really listening, paying attention. Because the trophies. It's already been clicked. Who does that? It shows you them. Oh, cool. That scared me though when I put that on. <laughs> yeah, everything's like mirrored. And that's basically where we are. Yeah, basically, that's where we are, and there actually is like a mini shell that looks like a bush outside, and I'll show you in a second. But that's where we are. It's very, very cool. All the lights are flashing. Talking to you about what was inside. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Do you want to get to it? Okay, so we've gone to the chip shed for today and we've got ourselves a Vinto from the Londis. The chip shed is there and the Londis is there. And we're gonna have a both gonna have cheeseburgers and chips. We've made a grave <laughs> mistake. We've made a mistake. <laughs> we've made a mistake. We've made a mistake. Let me stroke you. Let me stroke. If you're coming for food, let me stroke you. We've made a mistake, guys. <laughs> we've made a. They're circling us. They're circling us. You guys just saw us get attacked by ducks, but the chip shed. What would you rate it out of ten? Two. I'd rate it a 2 out of 10 as well, actually. <laughs> the... No, actually, I feel bad. I'd give it a 3. Okay, a uh, 2 for an actual score, and a uh, feel bad for them 3 from Morgan, and definitely a 2 from me. The We ordered, we ordered a cheeseburger and chips, as you saw, the uh, bird, birds, uh, the ducks, basically ate all the chips. Uh, the chips were dry and not very nice, and the burger, the cheese was burnt. They burnt the cheese on the burgers, and the uh, the actual burger meat itself was wasn't exactly cooked properly. So yeah, do not go there. Okay, guys. So I hope you guys did enjoy this little video walking down by the road by the river. I hope you guys did enjoy our little bit of a walk around in the water and of course at the beginning of the video us walking around the boating museum a couple more vlogs to go 
um, stuff here. There's one more thing we need to do here, which is the railway thing, uh, because in a couple of, and in a couple uh, a couple of days we'll be. So let's go up on Tuesday, and then on Thursday there'll be a video of the model village. And again, we do have to come back to look around the railway store. But yeah. Like I said, hope you guys did enjoy. Hope to you guys next time. And good. Bye. Anyway, we well, need to go there as well. We need to go. Like time, so. But I want to go to the bird land. And there's a maze. So there's two more things we need to do. So there's three things we need to do here. Three. <laughs> Hope you guys did enjoy. <laughs> Those people are a little bit strange, but <laughs> sure. But anyway, guys, hope you guys did enjoy, and hope to see you guys next time. Good bye. Look, see, I remember when I met you as a sophomore. Started out as friends, but I knew that we would want more. Hit your favorite restaurant with your favorite dress on. That's one of my favorite memories.